TGIF Orange County. I'm Jennifer Gillardy, and I've got your juice on OCRegister.com. The juice sent Brian. He's getting known as the ladies' man around here on a very tough and serious assignment. Poor baby. This is Brian Dawson, and I'm the luckiest man on earth in the center of centerfolds at the Playboy Wallen Release Surfboard Party. We got some uh, surfboards here that have the Playboy logos on them, custom designed by Wallen, and uh, this party's out of sight. About three years ago, I saw an episode of The Girls Next Door with my wife, and I wanted to make some boards for the girls, and had an idea to bring them up to the mansion. It all worked out, and now we have a global license with them. There's something for everybody. That's the cool part about it, is that we're just trying to throw as much out there as we possibly can. Everybody seems to be responding to it. I actually have been surfing a few different times on the Playboy board. So Get out of town. How does it ride? It rides nice. <laughs> There's 60 different designs. You can mix and match it. You can customize it by changing the colors. There's you know, they have everything from just a regular board, retro board, long board. And they have everything for everyone, any body, shape, size, whatever you prefer, they have it for you. So Nice. Almost like the magazine. Yeah, exactly. Orange County, it's your last weekend to take advantage of the fine dining of South Coast Plaza. Through Sunday, select restaurants are featuring their four-course menus for only $40. That's insane at most of these places that only usually buys you an appetizer. Participating restaurants include the brand new eateries from renowned chefs Charlie Palmer and James Hamamori, as well as some OC faves like Marche Moderne and Antonello. Love the accent. It's not exactly Happy Meal prices, and you don't get a cute little toy or anything. But hey, with food like this, I say it's a much better deal. And if you're a foodie, you don't want to miss it. The U.S. Open of Surfing brought people in from all over Orange County to Huntington Beach this past weekend. The crowds were insane, and Brian Dawson, a.k.a. the man in the sand, and yours truly, had tons of fun in the sun. The Orange County Fair leaves town this weekend, so don't miss your last chance to eat some fried food like Snickers, funnel cakes, all the good stuff, spin around, maybe get sick, and make some new friends. Ryan Dawson headed down to find out what's not to miss. So, Logan, do you like coming to the fair? Yeah, it's really awesome. What is your favorite part about the fair? I really like the rides and the food. Have you eaten anything fun yet today? Yeah, I've, eat, I've eaten deep fried Oreos. I'm going to do my best. That's it. 121, that's good. Mr. Johnson, your vote didn't count. A single or regular ballot is holding up a final decision for the American presidency. So many. One American citizen will effectively choose the next president of the United States. This week's Friday's flick includes Cal State Fullerton alum Kevin Costner. In his latest film, Swing Vote, Costner plays a beer swigging slacker whose vote will decide who becomes the next president. That's a scary thought. Looks like this local is back to his lovable self, handsome devil that he is, and he just keeps getting better with age, doesn't he, ladies? And what you may not know is that Costner put up some of his own money to make the film. You can read all about it in Barry Kaltnow's interview with OC's Golden Boy over there. Great interview, Barry. Juice was brought to you by Macy's. Thanks to Brian Dawson for taking on those really tough assignments today. And check back Monday for more on OCRegister.com slash juice. Web TV for OC.